today we're going to talk a bit more about the powertrain of the Forza 8. As most of you might know, the uh, Forza is driven by a fuel cell, buried deep inside in this packaging. That gives us our electrical power that is then used up in the electrical motors located over here. And we also have a buffer buried deep inside there that stores our energy in between. Well, uh, it turns out that a fuel cell is a quite curious device, namely for every single power level there is one specific voltage. Um, on the other hand, we also have the buffer that also has a specific voltage for how fully charged it is. As you can imagine, that doesn't really work together and we need to find a solution for that. Well, what do we use for that? A so-called DC-DC converter. You put one single DC voltage in and you can choose the DC voltage out and that is what we use to connect the two uh, devices. Well, it turns out that that is actually quite a difficult thing uh, to build, so we buy that. And then what is it actually what the powertrain department does? Well, the connections between the fuel cell and the DC-DC converter, and on the other hand, the DC-DC converter and the buffer and the motors, is actually quite difficult once you have 400 amps racing through it. Those uh, boxes we call junction boxes, and that is specifically what the powertrain department does. And well, once you have built those, then you have basically a full-time year at Forza together.